Unlikely things to hear on Doctor Who. <laughs> when, when I was giving you a quote as your cleaner, Doctor, I was giving you a quote from the outside. <laughs> No, there, there, there isn't going to be a new doctor. I'm being replaced by a helpline. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is the last time we park the TARDIS outside the port at Glastonbury. <laughs> <laughs> Davros, we meet again. Oh, Lord Sugar, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Hey, saw you from across the TARDIS, and I think I regenerated in my pants. Doctor, Doctor, you must help me. I think I'm a pair of curtains. <laughs> uh, tragic news about the Ood. There's been a terrible flood. They tried to escape into the wood, but it didn't do any good. And now they're all dude. <laughs> no, I'm the doctor who works for the World Health Organization. <laughs> yes, I mainly hang around young women. Yes, I was on television in the 1970s. Where are you going with this? <laughs> You've got to believe me, Clara. This is our best chance. Now, unzip my flies and I'll explain later. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go forward in time by an hour. Then we get a quid off the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> now, the first thing to remember on Planet Xenon is turn off data roaming. <laughs> so... We are ten million years in the future. H.G. Wells has just got married. <laughs> <laughs> you are the doctor. I am the tracheotomy patient. <laughs> I am the doctor. I am 1,200 years old. And this is my assistant, who's 27. <laughs>